Hey everybody, um, I wanted to inform you about the whole name change thing because uh, someone suggested that I would. I'm sorry that I didn't get to make this video last week or upload it last week because um, my computer decided that it didn't like the HDMI port anymore. So I no longer have HDMI. Now I'm working with the older one. I, I, he, Ricardo just told me what it was, but I just forgot. But it's the blue one that you like screw into the computer that doesn't have any sound. But he also had a sound port, so he gave me one of those as well. So yay, thank you again. Um, no, I, I did the whole name change thing because if you looked up my name without like the underscore or anything, there were so many other people that had the same name. So I decided that I would try to change it up, see, just think of things, and uh, a couple other people helped me think of things to, um, to, to just change the name. So I did a couple searches to see how many people would show up with a couple of the names, and I came up with, uh, Ricardo thought of Blazing Creations, no, cre Blazing Creativity or something like that, wait, wait crap, wait, hold on, Ricardo thought of Blazing Creations, and I looked that up, and there was, like, a couple people that had that as well. So I decided to change it to Blazing Creativity, and um, there was only like one person that showed up with that, so I was like, perfect, I mean, what, it's better than, I would prefer zero to just show up, but at least there's more, it's less than like 10 people like it was with the whole Blazing Wolf, so I changed it to Blazing Creativity, and, uh, that also is going to, like, shorten my signature to just Blazing, or Blaze, so that'll kind of work out for me, too. Um, the other thing I wanted to talk about is, uh, I'm finished with the Mirror Project. I finally finished it. The only thing I have to do now is staple it and or glue it or whatever to the frame, and it is a finally done. So, I don't think I'm going to record attaching it to the frame because that'll only take like five minutes, maybe probably less than that, three minutes, and that's not long enough a video for me. So, um, I am just going, I think I have like seven videos, like a whole week's worth of it. So I'm going to post one at a time throughout, like, uh, remember, I'm posting, I'm trying to be posting twice a week. So, and I know I haven't been doing that because all kinds of stuff has been happening. But that's what I'm trying to be doing is twice a week. And um, while I'm posting those, I will be making constant videos every day until I get a job, and then hopefully on my days off, which will hopefully be at least twice a week, two a week, and within those two days I'll be making videos, and then on, I'll keep on track from now on. But, uh, yeah. I hope you're excited, because I'm excited about the Mirror Project. I'm so... Glad to be done with it. It looks great. But. It didn't for a little while. It looks kind of weird at first. But then I painted it. So. Hopefully y'all like it. And it's. After this video. Like. Today's Monday. I'll probably post it on Thursday. So yeah, um, 
I'm trying to do, I'm going to start trying to do videos of Tuesdays and Thursdays to keep up with this and keep up with everything else, you know, not have any problems. Um, I am going to be trying to get my hair's a mess. I'm sorry. I'm trying to fix it. It's, it's freaking out while it's drying. I just got out of the shower. But, um, as soon as I am done today, like with this thing, I'm going to be making more videos, uh, drawing videos, especially because now I have an area where I can put the camera stand and have it angled. I would prefer to wait till I have the other camera stand, but y'all are probably not wanting to wait any longer, so just bear with me. Um, and hopefully the angle looks good. If it doesn't, then that sucks. But if it looks good, great. Um, I can't guarantee a really good angle until I get that thing I talked about last episode, uh, last video, I mean, about, you know, the little GoPro on the camera stand that clips onto the disc. Those will guarantee good angles, I promise. This one I can't guarantee because of the height of the camera stand and how far it tilts and nonsense but hopefully it looks good and uh yeah i don't know which drawing i'm doing next yet uh y'all are just gonna have to find out so yay actually i could probably just draw right here honestly instead of over there um that might just be for paintings and stuff for the drawings, I'll probably just draw right here because there's so much space on this desk that I can, so. Um, but yeah, I, sorry, that was weird. I accidentally clicked something, but um, I hope y'all enjoyed this video and I hope you're in going, <laughs> sorry. I hope y'all enjoy the other videos, like the the mirror project and the drawings that are coming out soon. Um, once again, like I said last episode, I'm lowering the prices on all my stuff. Like the paintings are probably gonna be ten bucks now. No, fifteen. The paintings are gonna be fifteen. Uh, that's for a that's the original. The prints that I will make in the future eventually are going to be 10 to, ten bucks. And once again, if you go on my Patreon, it'll be $5 off on both of those and blah, blah, blah. Uh, so check that out. Go in the description, check out my Patreon, and you'll see uh, multiple different tiers and all kinds of benefits for them. If you have any suggestions on what benefits I should change, let me know in the description. And, uh, yay. I think that's all I have to talk about. Oh, the wood projects, I mean. The wood projects that I'm working on as well are also lowered the price. They're going to be 20 bucks. Once again, they're a little bit more expensive than paintings because wood is expensive. And I, yeah. But I'm lowering the prices. Original projects... They're, I can't print them, so they're going to stay at 20 except on my Patreon again, which will be $5 off, so then they'll be 15 so if you go to Patreon, you get big discounts. Pretty big discounts. Decent-sized discounts. Whatever you would call that. I, I, I think that's a fairly okay discount. Um... If you think I should lower them even more, let me know, and I'll I'll think about it and see thing, how things go. Um, the wood painting that I have... This guy, the abstract wood painting. I think I'm just going to sell him for 15 Even though it's a big project I don't really I don't know y'all y'all decide what I should do give me advice let me know 
help me out it would be greatly appreciated but that's all i have to talk about today and um keep an eye out for thursday see ya bye